being me both of you here today. It gives me great privilege to welcome um, Saruna Sundarajan, Secretary Department of Telecommunications and Chairperson of the um, Telecom Commission. Um, as you know, we are here today for a very specific reason, which is the launch of the M2M report uh, that has been put together by um, Vicky and Ian Y. Um, this report essentially um, covers a whole range of issues, um, market sizing, potential use cases, which are the sectors in which we believe there will be explosion. Probably the most definitive report that's come out after the registration of uh, M2M, the draft was floated, followed by the consultation that TRA has had. I can go into a lot of details in this, but I think there's a presentation that follows. Needless to say that M2M has this, or at least is perceived to have this incredible future in terms of numbers and impact on business and society. But more importantly, it has a definitive impact on not developing countries such as India, uh, where we are leapfrogging technologies, went from you know nearly no fixed lines to a billion mobile phones. And in many ways, I think, um, Adam will sort of bear with me, but I think we are at a stage where machine to machine and IOT technologies in India are at where mobile was in 95, 96. People had sort of flirted with it for a while and then sort of grown up. I just want to remind ourselves when we speak about a billion mobile subscribers, sort of just the numbers that you know in terms of growth of what happened back then. For the first six years in the mobile telephony business, we had 2.5 million subscribers. In the next six years, 250 million subscribers. And the last six years, um, about 700 million subscribers. So the hockey stick does sort of climb up fairly quickly, but we are in what is probably 95, 96, and those numbers are not to be scoffed at. Now this could be obviously telescoped much faster because we have moved along and our ICT is now embedded in almost every single industry and someone yesterday called it the backbone of every sector. And I think IoT will play that role and we'll see some of that presentation.